Hello friends, how are you? How's your day going? Let's uh, get into this video. As you know by now, my name is Cosmina and I'm making beauty videos. If you're new here, please consider to subscribe. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. That will help me a lot and I will appreciate it a lot. And uh, yeah, let's get with the okay. video. Cause, because today I am excited. This is a brand that I only tried, I believe a lipstick from them and brushes. That's it. <laughs> Nothing else than that. But with the holiday and Black Friday going on, I have ordered a lot of um, a lot of mystery boxes. And one of them, it was a mystery box with Morphe. And they had two to choose from. One was an eye collection and one was face and eye collection. So I chose face and eye collection. And I think that was... A little bit more expensive I think it was like 50 something dollars and um, I said okay I'm gonna go for it I don't care I want to see what I get in it and when it came I wasn't able to film for a few days so I was like you know what I'm just gonna open it myself and then later on I'm gonna present it what it was in there so that's what I did I did open it myself yeah. just because I was very curious to see what it is in and here it is, I'm gonna show you what I got, but also we're gonna play with it and just kinda see how it is gonna look like on my skin. So here it is, right? I got two lipsticks. This is a, a lip gloss, brilliant lip gloss, I guess, in Prose. And then this is a lip crayon in IRL right here and then we got a steamy liquid uh, a steamy lipstick a mega matte super matte steamy lipstick and then we got a blushing babes pop of pink plush trio right here and then we also got premium lashes and uh, morphe premium lashes in posh and then two brushes i got um an r11 which is deluxe oval shadow brush and then i also got an r39 taper blender brush right here and then we got a big morphe palette and this one is 350s nature glow shimmer so I'm going to open it up because I haven't. <laughs> I just, you know, my life is crazy sometimes. I wish I had time to um, go and, and record every video that I want, that I have plans for, and also edit every video that I do record but i don't have all that time um and once again uh like i said before i am working 40 hours a week and i do have a marriage i do have a house and i do have friends and i'm trying to be everything but it is very hard sometimes very hard to ju uh, to juggle all all of them at once also i get sick i got sick <sighs> crazy it's been crazy <laughs> okay so this is how this thing looks like it is gorgeous i mean it, it's it's a huge palette i don't know when i will ever finish this um i never tried their products before so i mean their eyeshadow palettes before so i am definitely interested to see how this looks like all of this we are gonna use it so we're gonna start with the blush because i have everything done on my face except my eyes and uh, my blush and i do want to put the blush first so i am gonna go in with okay so i'm gonna go in with i'm gonna i'm gonna dip in all three of them you know i'm just gonna go on all three and just kind of go from there that looks really good I do enjoy how that looks. Hmm. Oh 
yeah. I like it. I actually like it a lot. Excuse my little dog. He is uh, hearing some deers crossing the property or something. I don't know. Um, but yeah, look at that. That is really pretty. And it blends in really beautiful. I dipped in all three of them and it looks really good with my complexion. Now let's go to the palette and just try to do a look with it. Um, I'm not, I'm not sure what type of look to go with, but from what I can see, there's only probably one, two, three, four, five, maybe, matte, and all the rest are shimmers. So, uh, <laughs> we'll see how this is gonna go. Um, I am gonna go in with this color right here. I don't know what this color is. Probably, do they have the... No, they don't. They don't have any... They don't have any color names. Interesting. Okay, so I'm gonna go with this color right here. All over my lid. Um, I am thinking... Just to kind of give it a little bit of dimension to the eye. I'm going to go with this one right here. This looks like a really pretty color. Okay, I like that. I like how it looks. That's really nice. Alright, so there's some colors in here that I really, really want to dip in. But I don't want to go too crazy, but I don't want to go to safe. So, pew, what am I going to do? Mm, there's this, there's these two colors right here that are just gorgeous and they're calling my name. They're saying, try me, try me, try me. And, hmm, and I'm going to do it. Start with the orangey shade. If you're asking yourself why am I only using the same brush, because this same br this brush, it's a miracle worker. I absolutely love this brush, and this brush is Soft Dome Brush from Makeup Geek. Love this brush. Alright, and now we're going to go with that greenish color. And then I want in my corner, I'm going to go with Morphe X Jaclyn Hill JH33. Now I am going to go with what color? I'm going to go with this one right here. This one is pretty dark. Or should I go with this one? I'm going to go with this one. Yeah, gonna go with that one. And then I want to use something for my inner corner, and I'm just gonna go with. Hmm, I'm thinking this shade right here, and I'm using a Luxie 141 Mini Round Brush to do that so for my under eye I'm thinking to go with this one and then I'm gonna go with this brush which is Morphe X Jaclyn Hill JH40 and I am uh, intrigued by this color right here so I want to put a little bit of that under my eye I think I got a bunch of fallouts under my eyes, so let's see if it's easy to clean it up. Oh yeah, very easy. And I'm just gonna get one of these big brushes, Morphe M532, and just blend everything together. And that's how it looks like. I mean, I really enjoy it. 
Um, there's the orange. I would say I was expecting it to be a little bit more. Uh, what is it? Have a little bit more kick, more fire to it. The same thing with the green. But overall, they look really good. Um, it, they're very easy to blend. Uh, the fallouts they go. You can remove it really fast. Then had any problems with that. I uh, I was able to put one on top of the other and still work really nice and really pretty. Yeah, I would say the green, the orange and the green, I thought they're going to be a little bit more pigmented and just kind of have a little bit more fire, but they do not, especially the orange, the way it looks over here. I thought, oh yeah, that's going to be really strong, but it wasn't. Um... I do enjoy this color that I put under my eyes. It looks really nice. I like them. I mean, it's not... I can't say it's a bad uh, product because it's not. It is one of the greatest products. No, it is not. But I do like it. I enjoy it. It's it's easy to work with. Uh, especially, like, I, I think if you're a beginner and you really want to experiment a little bit with colors and you want to see a little bit of blending to see how it pairs with everything morphe it's the way to go you know it's not uh they i know they have really affordable um ones i, I believe this might be only 20 bucks i have no idea i haven't even looked it up but i'm gonna do that and i'm gonna leave it on the screen uh so you guys know but yeah it is it is pretty it looks good it looks really good all right, let me um, go ahead and apply a little bit of mascara, and then I'm going to come back, and then uh, we are going to do lips. All right, so off camera, I decided to put a little bit of an eyeliner, too, so I can tie the whole look together, and I do like how it looks really sharp, All right? All right. Now let's go and see how this lips product are going to perform on me and just figure it out, you know. Alright, so let's see. I know I have a, they said a lip gloss and this one is a lip pencil or something. Let's see what this is. Uh -huh. Okay, it's a lip crayon. Should we go with red or should we go with, nah. We're just gonna go with this one to see how we're gonna look like. So it's a nice creamy uh, lip crayon. I mean, I don't know. It just kind of feels. Hmm. It feels like it has more color in my hand than on my lips. I had some lip oil on my lips from earlier, but. I don't think that should be a problem. It's not a bad color, but it's just, eh. You know what I mean? Like, eh. Not an amazing product either, but it's like, eh. All right, let's see how the lip gloss is looking like. Ooh, has some shimmers in it. It's called Froze. It has some scent to it, a really nice scent, like a berry scent, you know what I mean? It looks nice, doesn't smack anything. I mean, it's it's pretty, it goes with this eye look actually, it goes with this eye look a lot. So, yeah, it looks okay-ish. Let's see how this red color looks like. Steamy. Ooh, interesting name. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, I think that's a really fiery red. Ooh, yeah, look at that. Ooh, I kind of want to try it. Should I try it? No, I think it looks good with this. Yeah, I'll, I'll leave it like that. We'll try it on a different day. Um, I'm going to put it in my pile with things that I haven't tried. Because I'm going to make some videos with 
all the things that I have that I haven't tried yet. I have so many videos to make, but this is how it looks like. I'm gonna come a little closer so you can see. All right. So this is how it looks like. That's how my eye looks look like. Love the blush, it looks really pretty. The lips, that's how they look. It's a really nice, overall, it's a really nice look. Um, if you're interested to see what I use for my eyebrows, uh, don't forget to subscribe because I created a video before this one explaining everything that I did step by step and uh you don't want to miss that miss that so uh yeah that's it for today thank you so much for watching and for being here don't forget to subscribe like this uh video if you enjoyed it and uh press that uh, notification button have a nice one bye